Ayo fellas, how's it going? And welcome back to The Caregiver. We are returning to another Japanese styled horror game made by Chillizart. And this is uh, part two, probably the final episode, I think. I feel like I got through a large majority of the game last time, so I feel like it's gonna end today. At least I assume. I don't know how long the game is. It's very hard to tell in any of these games, like when it's gonna end. Usually things start off pretty chill at first, and then they ramp up like near the like the final like third, and that's when things really start to hit the fan. But I mean, maybe that's not gonna happen this time. Who knows, honestly? This is one of the more older games that Chillers Art made, so it's not like the convenience store or like the closing shift, you know, where it's like a little bit newer. But either way, I still want to check most of these out because they're really good so far, even the older ones. And each game has like a weird, different atmosphere that I really like. And it's kind of cool just like jumping around in like different settings, but like having a creepy like atmosphere to it, you know? Or just have like some sort of like creepy chill factor in the background. I like that. You know, like spooky Five Nights at Freddy's jump scare every like three seconds is cool and all. But when they like build up ambience with like the settings around you, that's what gets me pretty good, man. I love that. But uh, yeah, really quickly, shitting section, bazinga. Hey, sup guys, it's me. And this is the part of the video where I ask you to smash like, subscribe, and turn on notifications. It doesn't take long at all, and it really helps me out a lot. You gotta be part of the small percentage of people who are actually subscribed. Fellas, we reached 16k not too long ago, so thank you. Now let's start pushing towards 17k. And uh, yeah, the final episode of The Caregiver. Sorry it took a while for part 2 to come out. I just really wanted to start barreling through my Cuphead episodes and also Deltarune before the Cuphead DLC came out, so I didn't really feel comfortable editing this video until now. But uh, hey, at least better late than never, am I right? Anyways, with that all being said, enjoy the video. And uh, yeah, let's uh, let's continue. I believe last time we were like a person, right? Crazy, I know. I think it's jumping around in like different people. I'm pretty sure at least. Like at the start, we started off as like someone, and then I know like maybe halfway through, we like jumped to like another perspective. I think. See, now we're Naomi, but I think in the first episode we started off and we saw Naomi like being chilling on a desk. So. Now we're just, like, moving around in, like, different bodies. What's up? Hey, Rizako-san. What's up? Yeah, what's up, man? About Suichi. I think that's who we were playing in the first episode, like, at the start. This is weird. There's something wrong about his family. None of his family members were home. I feel very uneasy about it. I was wondering if Sachi-san knows anything. Hmm. You want to take a look at her work diary? Yes. That would help. Oh, and she's taking a sick leave again. Maybe you can visit her. See if she's doing okay. Alright. I don't know why I gave you like a, a weird like nerd voice, but okay. That that works, I guess. So where am I going exactly? I had to adjust my sound settings a little bit so I can actually hear now. Basically, if a jump scare happens, it's going to be like 10 times louder. So that's just wonderful. Okay, she said we have to find a work diary. Where is the work diary? Maybe I got to talk to the person at the front desk. I'm going to keep it a buck since part one. It has been about, like, maybe two months, so I kind of forget a lot of what happened. I'm pretty sure there was, like, a ghost or, like, some guy wandering around, like, an old man's house and, like, controlling him or something. Oh. She's gone. That's very mysterious. Okay, then. Do we not have to find the diary? Um, oh, never mind. It's right here. Okay. Day one, just a normal day at Suchi's, but there's one thing that bothered me. The house kind of smells? Where is it coming from? I should try getting rid of the stench tomorrow. Okay. Day two, I didn't know Suchi suffers dementia. He doesn't talk much, if not at all. This is odd. He was fine yesterday. Maybe his symptoms are starting to show now. I pray he will be okay. So, this is the diary from the person we were playing as in the first episode, in like the first half. And then something happened to where we, like, disappeared, I think. And now we're taking our perspective as Naomi now, who was, like, her friend of the person we were playing last episode. If that makes sense, alright? If it didn't, then, oh well, sucks to be you. Day 3. His family members were supposed to be at home today. They called us last minute that they can't make it. It's just Soichi at home today. I really wish they'd let us know sooner. Oh well, I shouldn't complain. Tried taking out the trash again and use the air freshener. Nothing seems to work. 
house still reeks of something rotten, probably a dead corpse. Day 4, when I arrived today, Soichi wasn't at home. Turns out he was lying on the ground outside. What's going on? I also hear scratching of walls and banging on ceilings. A hostage, oh boy, that is nice. I tried checking where the sounds were coming from. Nothing's there. Ah, the smell again. I just can't put a finger on where the smell is coming from. Everything about that house is driving me insane. Day 5, the room in the second floor. What was that? Grandma? Why are you here? What are you doing? It can't be real, right? I feel cold. Maybe I'm just sick. I shouldn't go to work tomorrow. And I guess that was the last of, uh, whoever I was playing as. I think Soichi is the grandpa we were taking care of. I'm pretty sure. And I guess we saw grandma, but I don't remember seeing grandma, but already then. What happened at Soichi's? Something's wrong with Sachi-san. I think that's who we were playing as. I have to go visit her. I can go now. From what I heard, she lives nearby. Wow, how helpful. I know where nearby is. It is everywhere around us. Thanks for the info, me. Now, from what I remember, Sachi-san lives nearby. She should be living in the tallest apartment building in this area. Okay, I always fail at instructions in these games. So, tallest apartment building in this area. Tallest. Tall. Big and tall brain, okay? You got to look for big and tall. Like that big tall building over there. Okay, tiny little dense brain. Did you understand that? Manka S? Yeah? Okay, don't get run over by a car, sure. Yeah? Never mind. Okay, don't go this way. I guess I go this way then. I'm gonna get jumped, I just realized. That's nice. Let's go. Alright, that's not weird at all. I'm, I mean, that was just like a normal crosswalk, but like, why was it on? They don't beep like that normally, right? Because ain't no one around there, that's for sure, unless this guy somehow pressed it and teleported over here. What's up, man? I won't let you pass. Uh, do I know you? No! So does that mean I can pass? No! You have the same uniform as the girl who lives here. That means I can't let you pass. Why do you hate the girl who lives here? Yeah, why? I don't even live here, exactly. It doesn't matter. You have to win it, a game of rock, paper, scissors. Then I'll let you pass. Bro, what is this? Like a stupid mini game segment now? Huh? Yeah, exactly, huh? Rock, paper, scissors, are you kidding me? Yeah, exactly. Shut up and listen, or I won't let you pass. All right, fine, man, be like that. All right, rock, paper, he, he's like trying to fight me. Wait a minute, no, rock, paper, scissors, right? Uh, here we go, rock, paper, Scissors! Shoot! Um... Bro, this is a game of luck! What do you mean? Okay. Let's think about this at a logical standpoint. His bald-ass head looks like a rock. We're gonna go with paper, alright? Because paper beats rock. Bada-bing, bada-boom. Crap! Ha! Huh. Too easy! Can't let you pass then! Bro... That's not even a door. <laughs> this is the door. I'm stupid. Here we go! Alright, let's try that again. Maybe because he has a bald-ass head, he's gonna choose rock. Or, no, he's not gonna choose rock, so he's gonna try to defend against rocks because he's he's insecure about his bald head. So then we gotta do rock. Wait, no. Wait, yes. Maybe? Uh, rock! Paper! God damn! Too easy! Catch that you pass then! What about scissors then, huh? Here we go, rock, paper, scissors, shoot, bada bing, bada boom, by process of elimination, RNG always beats you, man. At least if I get infinite tries. Ah! I lost! You're pretty strong! Mmm. Ah. However, you really thought I'd let you pass with just a game of rock, paper, scissors? No, actually. Originally, I thought you were just gonna whip out a gun and shoot me, but, you know, I'm still alive. Think again, loser. But you said, all I need is one thing. I know you have a lot of them. I know you do! Money? Because you are very wrong about that, sir. Have what? Bring me the drug. <laughs> I have drugs on me? Yo, Naomi getting risque! Wait a minute! Yo, Naomi up to some wild shenanigans, fellas. The drug? Stop playing dumb! I've been getting it from your friend! But she's acting weird lately and won't give me that damn thing! It runs off like a psychopath! You say that. Bring me the drug! And I'll let you pass! Do I have any? What is this? 
Nothing. Trash can? No. What do I gotta find a drug dealer now, huh? Okay, fine. Be like that. Any drugs? Maybe in the alleyway over here. Hey, hey, hey. Any drug dealers today? I'm looking for a hit. Maybe come to my shtick. I don't know, man. Um, what is this? Huh? Yeah, I want to read it. Mysterious card? Dude, it's a stupid Pokemon card. I got you baited. I thought that was like a drug pack right there. Some good old cocaine. Crouch? This would be a nice time to crouch, but alrighty then. Dude, just hop the gate over here. Literally, are you that unathletic? Really? My god, man. I remember there being like a monk somewhere. Maybe he has drugs for some reason? What's over here? Another goddamn Pokemon card, but it's an anime girl, so I'm I'm less mad. Either way, though, not what I was looking for. I don't need to go there right now. Alright, well, thanks for telling me. I would have walked in a random direction, that's why. This better not be a situation where if I talk to him again, he's gonna be like, Ah, oh, never mind, I don't want the drugs anymore. Or like, ah, oh, fine, I'll go easy on you for this once. And then she's gonna just let me pass. That better not be it. Why can't I go up here, by the way? What What is the point of this? It's a, another... Uh, this is going to be a common occurrence, isn't it? You're right, man. Well, at least I'm building up my own Pokemon deck. Unfortunately, I don't have drugs. Maybe the Scooby-Doo van will have some good kush? Nope, but it has that, of course. Why does it have a gun on it with that guy? Alrighty then. Cool, I guess. Maybe Sachi-san has, like, a bunch of, like, drug stash somewhere. Maybe. Perhaps. Does this have anything? No, this is the same exact thing from before. Alrighty then. No, yeah, I, I know, I know, I know, I know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Drugs. If I were drug, where would I be? Not that, but there is a cat, so I appreciate it. Drugs? Wait a minute. Drugs. That has to be it. All right, let's go. Could I have grabbed that from the start if I could? Then I feel kind of stupid for not clicking on everything before because this was a very big inconvenience. Hello, sir. I have the Ladrugas that you, oh, humbly requested. There you go, man. Ah, oh, yes. This. This. Ah, ha, 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 ha. All right, man. Have fun with that, I guess. Sweet. Enter the apartment. Sure, man. Let's go in, I guess. Let's get him. Is this the end of the game? This better not be the end of the game, man. I'm, like, recording a second episode, so if this is the end, then that's gonna really suck, because it's gonna be, like, a two-minute episode. Sexy, by the way. Oh, boy, hot dog. Let's go. Enter. Wait, is that her apartment? No. If anything, just go around and collect more cards first. Never mind. That is the only way I can go. Oh, uh, Sachi-san, uh, I am here to barge into your home. What is up, homegirl? It is your best friend, Naomi. What's up, girl? How's it going, girlfriend? My scat girl. Okay, lots of stuff to click on. That's nice. Yeah. Oh, this feels like the closing shift with like 15 interactables now. Oh. Oh, man. Um. Tea packet. Okay, mug. Uh. I feel like a caveman right now just clicking on things. What's up, Sachi-san? How's it going? I'm just gonna pretend you're not there. You want some good old tea, maybe? Good old nice box of tea? Why did that turn on? Okay. Sweet! Was it always cooking? I think it was, but alright. Mug of tea. For Sachi-san. Right? Yeah. Yeah. What's up, Sachi-san? Are you okay? It's really hard to see your face right now. It gets, like, very dark and creepy, like, right over here. Oh, my God. Maybe, yeah, maybe back up a little bit. How you doing? I feel like a toddler right now. Like, like, mommy, 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 mommy. Sachi-san, are you good? Give it to Sachi. Sure, yeah. There you go. Nice good old pat. Hmm. You are right now? Hmm. So cold. Don't worry, I think I just caught a cold. Hey, Sachi-san. So I came here to ask you something. I read your work notes and, uh... What happened at Soichi's? What happened to his family? They all died, probably. Why? 
Why? Why what? Why? Oh, I'm sorry. I forgot to mention. It's because I'm in charge of taking care of him now. Get out! Get out of here! Get the hell out of here! Huh? Get out! Get the hell out of here! I don't want to get involved anymore! Get out! Okay. Let me just ruffle through your things really quickly. And then I will be making my leave. Clickety clickety. Anything to interact with maybe. There was. Alright, I just stole your Pokemon card. Goodbye. Have a nice day, Sachi-san. Well, at least that wasn't the end. I don't know what's gonna happen now, but it wasn't the end. Uh, uh, Sachi-san, are you okay in there? Is this the ending? No, don't tell me that's it. What? Huh? Sachi-san, no! What the hell happened? Why did she just jump off of a building? Bro, she must have seen some messed up shit in there. God damn. Oh boy, it's not over. More content for me, but also more screams. Lovely. Why is the rain so audible inside? Wouldn't it be muffled if I was indoors? I mean, I get that maybe making a muffled effect would be kind of hard for the game. But like, at least make it quieter because this is just like unrealistic. My expectations of a video game reviewer have not been met. This is terrible. Where is everyone? I have to get to Soichi's. What is this feeling? I feel like I should hurry. Alright, that's great, man. Yeah, yeah, let's hurry. Why not, right? Yep, 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 yep. Alrighty then. Alright, cool. I think we're gonna get the ending now. Why not just take a car? What are you doing? This way. This is the way to the grandpa's house, right? I think so. There's like a monk here earlier. I don't know what happened to him. He, like, talked to me saying I should, like, join their, like, cult or whatever, but... I don't know, maybe it's too late for that now. Yeah, he was, like, there, so he's gone now. That's wonderful. I can't wait until I get possessed by a ghost. That should be oh so poggers. I can't wait until I see some apparitions, man. Let's go. Oh, boy. Uh, <clears throat> my voice. My voice, man. My voice. Any drugs? Not today, I guess. Grandpa don't got the good kush quite yet. Why is it louder in here? What is wrong with you? Wait, I'm gonna walk into like a death trap. Wait a minute, stop. If I were to protect myself, I would grab... Is this trash bag filled with like empty glass bottles? Because if it is, grab it and smack it at the closest person. Granted, you might accidentally hurl it at Grandpa and break his neck. But hey man, a small price to pay to save my life. Amen, baby. Amen. Oh, that's getting louder. Amen, baby. Amen. Hello, any dead bodies? The sounds that are happening do not make any sense in this house, but okay. You in here, Grandpa? This op- Oh, yeah, why is it open? Okay, maybe he did get the good kush, and he already got it. Cardrack? Why would I need that? I hate this. Every window I go near... Increases the volume of the rain by like tenfold. Um. Okay, the ladder's gone now. That's great. Flashlight? Yeah, sure, man. I love that it's there on the floor. You around here, Grandpa? Peepaw? I know last time he took a piss on the floor, so maybe he's just like drowning in his piss. What? There's rats? Okay, yeah, sure. Why? Ha. Huh? Wait, no, do- uh, what did I do? I got a key? Why is there blood, first of all? So many questions. None of them will be answered. I know that for a fact. Oh, that's so loud. Bro, I'm getting, like, massive sensory overload right now, dude. This sucks. Go upstairs, I guess? That's where I got jumped last time, I think. Naomi, like, died in here. Take a peek? No, not right now. Maybe in a couple seconds, but... What is this? Yeah, you know, take it to defend yourself, maybe. What the hell? What is that on the floor? Take a peek? Sure, I guess. Paranoia, huh? Why is there a crowbar on the floor, first of all? And second of all, what is that, like, pile of bags? Okay, wait, we got, like, stuff for a car, so I guess we gotta find a car now. Do we steal Grandpa's whip, or do I have my own? I don't know. But we're gonna find out, I guess, in a few seconds. Grandpa, you got a whip around here, dude? That is so loud, man. Oh my god. I'll try my best to fix it in after edits, guys, but I don't know, man. I'll see what I can do, I guess. 
Uh, dude, what is this Scooby-Doo van over here? Car jack. Use. No. Van key. Open the van. Yeah, sure, man. Alrighty, then. Ow, first of all, my ears. Dude, this is so loud, man. Car jack. Alright, I'll take it. Alright, what now? I got a car jack and a car, uh, j crank. Maybe I prop this up on the van, and then I scooby-doo the hell out of here, maybe? No, alrighty then. Any of this, any of this. I'm gonna make sure none of this works, because if I go back there and turns out I gotta go back here, I'm gonna be pissed off. I guess I leave now to go to my car that is, I guess, broken or something, I guess. I hope I don't get jumped in the middle of the road. That would be oh so terrible. Why is there just like a clipping piece of mud? Alrighty then. Hey man, this game is kind of old, alright? It's not their it's not their most recent project. Cut them some slack. Ooh, what's what what Scooby do? They're coming after you. We gotta solve that mystery. Hey dear Scooby do, they're coming after you. What's what Scooby do? I'm sorry, man. I don't know what else to say. My ears are being destroyed by these loud rain sound effects. I feel like I'm about to be jumped any second now. What is there left to do besides sing the Scooby-Doo theme song? Am I right or am I right? Call 911, goddammit. Here it is, car jack, I guess. Which one do I gotta use it on? Whichever car is broken or something. This one? No. This one over here? Maybe. Also no, actually. That's just wonderful. What about this one? Mm, doesn't look like it. Oh, wonderful. What about this one as well? Does not look like it as well. Wonderful. Wait. Okay, I got your beta. I thought I could go this way. Um. Goddamn. Yo, what the dog doing, though? Alright, I like that card. Never mind. Dude, this would be way less terrifying if it wasn't raining right now. I swear to God. Shut up. Thank you. Huh. Enjoy the slight peace and quiet while it lasts, fellas. Because it is going to go away as soon as I step near any one of these windows. And trust me, there's like a thousand in this house, man. Dude, I swear to God, I'm missing like one thing that is like detrimental to everything. Is there something on the floor over here or am I being weird? These slide doors are stuck somehow? That's what I had to do? Maybe I can use a B something to force it open. One of these? Maybe I can use something to force... Yeah, how about this? Take a peek? No. How about you use the car... Wait, I did use it. Wait. Okay, these slide doors are... Yeah, do it. Use the car... Yeah, do it. Do it. Yeah, just do it, all right? Okay, there we go. I figured out what to do. I thought I had to use it for a car, all right? Because it gave me a car jack and, like, a car bumper thingy, all right? My bad, dude. My bad. Anyways, time to die. Let's get him, brother... brother brothers. All right, I got all my heebie-jeebies out of my system, all right? Just kill me. Do it. Come on, do it. You put an item there to debate me, but I know you're gonna stab me any second now. Watch. Or not, never mind. I had to use both items, I guess, for some reason. Great, what about you just, like, use your own body mass and, like, squeeze yourself through a door? Because even if these things were sliding to, like, be shut down, I know it's possible to get through with just human strength, but alrighty then. Crowbar? Yeah, man, that's great. A bloody note? Yeah, that's also great, man. Good fortune comes beneath the floor. Okay, money, let's go, I guess. Yeah. Yeah, man, money, let's go. Hey, you said you, you put some money somewhere, man? Oh, sweet, Grandpa's fortune? He must have died already. Oh, sweet, we get his will. Pog, oh, money, oh, let's go, man. Oh, sweet. I'm gonna invest all these on, on Fortnite free bucks. Oh, let's go, man. Oh, let's go. Oh, puggers, man. Puggers. Is there like something somewhere that I gotta like lift up? Probably. But the question is where? There is a lot of this guy's floor all over the place. Which one do I click on? Surely it's not outside, right? That would be just stupid. Oh. Pride open. How would I even know? This looks like a completely normal floor, but alrighty then, sure man, pry this specific board open. Let's get some money man, and not a dead body man. Oh sweet man, basement floor, Pog, let's go down! Dude, this sucks man, this sucks. Oh boy, what does grandpa have to hide? Why does he have a cave down here? 
How did grandpa build a cave under his house? The dude could barely even walk and look at me. How could he do all this? Alright, man. At least the stupid sounds of rain is gone. That's nice. Honestly, even if I am about to die, the sweet release of death is honestly a lot more satisfying than that stupid, loud, blaring rain sound effect. Like, blaring at my ears 24-7. So honestly, if you're gonna kill me, whatever, man. I'll accept it now. Thank you for at least not deafening me. That is much obliged. Why does... Uh, why... Uh, dude, what the hell is, is... Wait, is he being sacrificed? Did I see that right? Mocha ass. Sorry, that was weak. A mocha ass. Slightly better. What am I looking at? It's like all dark. Is that Satan? Am I looking at Satan right now? I can't tell. Dude. Also... What's going on with Grandpa over here? Is that Grandpa? I didn't get a good look. Is that Sachi-san or... Wait, but Sachi-san jumped off a building. But maybe Grandpa took her dead body and then slapped her on the crucifixion cross. Oh, never mind. That is a demon. That is Satan. Never mind. Oh. That is so poggers to look at. Oh, wonderful. Is that Grandpa? He looks a little bit different from how I remember him. Grandpa, what big teeth you have! No. What the hell was that? Hey. Never mind. What's up, Grandpa? How's it going, man? You good, man? What the hell was that? I just heard footsteps. That's not good. That's not good at all. I can go past that? No. Why'd you let me go there? Oh, dear God. Grandpa, what happened to you? He, he got got, he got, he got, he got, he got got, man, he got got, grandpa. What the hell? Okay, bloody note. The time of the deeds have been engraved to the LJD clocks. Bro, why'd you take it out on grandpa, though? The mother got stabbed while preparing dinner, and the clock struck 3.30. The girl was strangled when she was coming back from school, and the clock struck 8.10. The boy got pushed down the stairs, and the clock struck 5.40. The father pushed down from the window, and the clock struck 11.50. Huh? The gods will aid when the timepiece is aligned. Awesome, man! That's real- No! Ah, grandpa! Hey, yo, chill out, Grandpa! Hey! I- 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 I didn't see anything, man! I didn't see nothing! We good, right, Grandpa? We good, huh? We homies? Yeah? Yeah? We're actually good? Wait a minute. We homies now? We being chilling? What's up, man? Are we being chilling now? Okay, no, 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 we're not, we're not, we're not. Never mind, never mind, never mind. That's, that's the killer, by the way, I think. Do I escape now? Is he following me still? Where, the, where is he? Where, where, where? Don't back me in a goddamn corner. Do I leave? Cla yeah, get out of here, what are you doing? Bro. Bro. Where'd she go? What are you doing? <laughs> ah! Oh my god! Ah, wait, I can leave! Ah! Uh, back down I go! Goodbye, Grandpa! <laughs> what the hell is happening? Grandpa got sacrificed and now he's here? Wait, is, is the other guy still here? Was that the same guy? I don't even know still. Oh my god, I need a second. I didn't expect there to be another chase sequence in my defense. Are we good now? I got stabbed multiple times, but after 30 seconds- <laughs> Stop! He came out of nowhere! What do you mean? Yes, go up! What are you doing? Dude, don't stab me in the middle of a cutscene. That's rude. Uh, dude, he's gonna- he's gonna be anywhere! Where are you going? What are you doing? Stop! Okay, he's gonna be- he's gonna be right here. Where am I? Ah! Go! Go! Just go! Go past him! I got stabbed like 17 times now. Oh, never mind. I cannot. Oh, we are not being chilling anymore. Ah, uh, being chilling. Grandpa, please, man. I'd do anything, man. Upstairs? Upstairs? Maybe? Where do, I, where do I go upstairs from? I don't remember. Don't be over here now, please. Okay, thank you. I went in a goddamn circle. I'm stupid. Okay, go back here. And then go back here. And then go through here. And then through here. And then, maybe, no, not through there, but over here. And then not there, but over here. Wrong way, moron! Ru okay, never mind, right way, actually, right way. 
Stop screaming. Stop screaming. You're good. Go. What the hell? Is he getting closer? I can't tell. Grandpa? You you over here, Grandpa? Peepa? Big P? Why? I gotta remember! Ah! Nah. No, close. What are you doing? Does Grandpa come upstairs? I gotta know right now. Does he come upstairs? Oh, uh, okay. I'm safe here, right? No, there's a wide open area, you idiot. I don't remember. I forgot. I forgot. Wait, wait. What is the dog doing? Grandpa? Peepaw? Okay, he's right there. Alright. Um, I don't know where to go. Over the trash I go. Downstairs I go. Back down, I guess. What the hell? That's not fair. I'm going in a cutscene. Dude, and now he's gonna be somewhere over here, right? What the hell are you do- What? Uh, hey? Alright, debated. Oh my god, load, load W. Wait, I gotta- I gotta read the note though. Bro, get out of here. Is he still falling? I don't think he is. Stealth. Stealthy. I'm not gonna remember this. I'm taking a picture of this. Screw this, man. Alright. Hey, welcome to 2022, fellas. We take pictures of information now, actually. You wanna know what this is called? Using your brain meets, fellas, alright? This ain't cheating. I'm just using my resources, guys. It also ain't cheating if you don't get caught. Am I right or am I right? So let's get the hell out of here, not get stabbed, wind up the clocks, and then we win these, I guess. No, oh, what the fuck? I mean, what the... No, whatever, don't even blur it out. It's it's not even meant for, like, children, all right? This episode of this episode of Five Nights at Fongo's is not for the, the faint of heart. So, screw you, all right? Where is the... Ah! Jesus, does Grandpa come upstairs? Oh, Lord, Grandpa comes upstairs, man. He he can walk perfectly fine, man. Oh, Lord, have mercy. He right behind me, man. He right behind me. Oh, Lord, have mercy. Hey, you can't come in here. He can come in here. He can face through the walls, actually. Never mind. Never mind. Never mind. Uh, debated. Oh, my God. Low, low W. Goodbye, Grandpa. Ha, 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 God damn, man. God actually dead. What? Wait, wait. I gotta remember those. Ah! Ah, there's multiple clocks. I didn't know. I didn't know. Ah, shit. Oh! Oh, my God. Dude, I can't do this with a man chasing me the entire time. I gotta look at my phone, all right? Jesus. Oh, he's right behind me again. I need to buy myself some time somehow. I'm walking in a circle. Stop. Oh, my God. Go this way. Go in a full entire loop, all right? Grandpa? Peepaw? You coming this way, man? You're gonna, you're gonna camp the clocks? Is that what you're doing? Is there a clock somewhere around here? Oh, you, now you follow? Dude, you are the worst, man. You are the abs- I'm going upstairs. I'm going upstairs first. Alright, which one is upstairs? Um, upstairs? I can't check right now. Um, upstairs, 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 upstairs. Where is upstairs? Up over here is upstairs. Okay, I don't think he knows where I am. So we go in here. Close that damn door. Watch your back. Can I pause for a second? Is that a pause? I don't even know. Um, upstairs. The man got stabbed while preparing dinner, so in the kitchen. She got home for. I can't speak right now. Okay, wait, compose yourself. I know Grandpa's like. Does that work? I don't even know. I know Grandpa is super close, but like, you gotta compose yourself so you can talk for the video, alright? Don't have a panic attack, just chill. Bing chilling, we are bing chilling. Bing chilling. The girl was strangled when she was coming back from school, and the clock was 8 10, alright? I don't know what that means. School? Maybe the front door, if anything? I don't know. The boy got pushed down the stairs, so that's probably the one where I'm standing, because this is, like, upstairs, right? The father pushed down from the window, and the clock struck 11.50. So, the one that I'm standing at right now is either 5.40 or 11.50. Okay, do it, do it, do it. Um, wait. Oh, I, I, I... Ah, ah, go out, go out, wait, 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 wait. Why? Stop doing that. I hate that. I'm gonna try 11.50 first, alright? I'm gonna try 11.50. Dude, I swear to God. That's right, right? 
11. Was that correct? I don't know. Maybe it did the ding. Grandpa? Grandpa? Where are you, Grandpa? Where art thou beeth? Grandpa, there you are, Grandpa. He knew. He heard the ding. He heard. He definitely heard that. Okay. Um, this way we go then. Open sesame, dickhead! My god. Alright. Um, lunch. No, that's not the lunch table. That is the lunch table, but he's probably like two feet next to me. So, we go... Hide in the closet, alright? Hey, welcome to Pride Month, fellas. <laughs> he Pepe enough new! Oh my god, man! Oh lord Jesus! Dude, I can't handle this. I can't handle this. I can help... I... 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 I can handle scripted jump scares. When the jump scares happen at random and he's following me forever... I can't! I can't! Is there a clock in here? There ain't. There ain't. Can you close that? So dinner is 3.30, alright? Dinner is 3.30. Just go. Just go. Alright, power three. If you see grandpa, who cares? If you see grandpa... Wait, there's one over here! Wait, 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 which one is this? Wait, the, the father was pushed down from the window and the clock struck 11.50. This is a window! What are you doing? Okay, whatever, man. 11.50, is this one the correct one? They both ding, don't they? They don't? Let's try 5.40, I guess. Uh, uh, he's gonna stab me when I'm doing the clock, I swear to god. Okay, I guess that was correct, I guess. Grandpa heard that? Gra uh, you who Grandpa, uh, where also thou beeth, Grandpa? Are you over here, Grandpa? Come out of the shadows, Grandpa. Uh, you who you who you who There you are, Grandpa. Hello there, Grandpa. How are you doing on this fine day? Allow me to, uh, shimmy on this way, I guess. This is a dead end. Is this the- What the hell? He's- He's being chilling over here. Ugh, okay. Kitchen. Is there one in the kitchen? I didn't see it. God damn it, I didn't get to check. Let's look for more clocks, I guess, while he's chasing me. So... No, no, oh my god. That still got me. Is there one near the door? There's not. Where is the other clock? Dude, I don't like how he's so fast. Grandpa, where'd you get all this energy from? I know you're probably possessed right now, but like, come on, man. We're gonna run all the way back. Dude, why would you do that on the door? Um, okay, run to the kitchen. Okay, this is your time. This is your time to do the kitchen one. Um, 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 kitchen, kitchen, preparing dinner, 3.30, 3.30, 3.30, 3.30. Bing, 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 bing. I missed it. Wait, no, I didn't. That was the right one. Okay, bing, 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 bing. Okay. All right, man. Grandpa's gonna come over. Fantastic. We have one more. We have one final one. Grandpa, where you at? Come out from the shadows. Wait, one sec. Let me just check. The girl was strangled when she was coming home from school and the clock struck 810. Where is the final one? I don't know. Oh, hey, Grandpa. How's it going, man? Um, final clock. Final clock. She came home from school. That's like the, like, entrance, right? How would that not be the entrance? Dude, I'm so lost, man. I'm so lost. He's gonna come out from, like, right here. Unless he's not, and he's actually, like, back there. So I actually have... <laughs> he's literally right there, but thankfully the pause menu actually works. So, Grandpa, you chill over there for a second. Alright, fellas. Let's think about this. What room is important that we did not go into? I'm thinking the bedroom, which is to the right of me. So, what we're gonna do is we're gonna debate him. Look, Rat, there's a clock right there. There's a clock. Okay, it's a wrap. It's a wrap. It's a wrap. We won. We're gonna lead Grandpa upstairs. Oh, you who, Grandpa. Come this way. Uh, I have something to show you, Grandpa. I gotta find out where the stairs is first, actually, because I forgot. I forgot, actually. I actually forgot. I forgot. Alright, Grandpa. Up here. Uh, you who, Grandpa. Peepa, Grandpa. Up this way, sir. Right over here, Grandpa. Yep, 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 yep. Alright. Jubate him, jubate him, jubate him, jubate him, jubate him, jubate him. Close the door as well, close the door. Alright, jubate, jubate, jubate it. Oh my god, load, load W, plus two. Alright, let's get out of here. I went the completely wrong way, but it's fine. Over here, over here, over here, over here. Run, 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 run. 3.30. No, 8.10. 8.10 actually, 8.10. So, I think I messed up. Wait. 
six, seven. I messed up. God damn it. Wait, I might be able to do it. Eight, ten. Ding dong, ding dong. Ding dong, ding dong. Why is that open? Gun. There's a gun in there. Shoot, Grandpa. I don't know what that is, but it looks promising. All right, that's in the living room. Go. He's going to appear like right in front of me. I know that. I know. Go, 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 go. Power through it, power through it, power through it. Religious dagger. All right, what's good, Grandpa? I'm about to stab you with a god. Come at me, my boy. Come at me. I'm ready to dance. Come at me. Come at me. Have at ya. Have at ya, buddy. Have at ya. The exit? Okay, no. Wait. I actually know. Grandpa! Peepa! Big G! Big P! Where you at, mate? Where you at? Where you at, mate? Down here? Who knows? Let's go back down! Grandpa is about to catch these hands. Or actually, knives, but, you know, same thing. Grandpa? Don't hide from me, Grandpa. What's wrong? Are you afraid of God or something? What's wrong? It is just my religious dagger that I'm going to stab you with. I do not see what there is to be worried about, Grandpa. We're just having some fun here. We're just having some good old fun. Lots of good old fun with a knife, Grandpa. Yeah, you wanna you wanna come at me, Grandpa, huh? Don't hide from me now. Now that I have a weapon, all of a sudden now you're scared, huh? What about you, huh? You had a knife for like 15 minutes straight. And you couldn't kill me, huh? What a shame. What an absolute shame, Grandpa. Wait, maybe I use it on Grandpa downstairs. Now you're using your brain meats. There we go. That actually might be it. Because Grandpa's just gone, alright? He's, he's like, no more. The dude does not exist anymore. Even though they're doing, like, the creepy, like, sounds. Dude is just gone, alright? So that means we take this to the holy site. What's up, Grandpa? Or the real Grandpa. What's good? And it's a wrap. Sorry, I had to do it, man. God rest your soul. Okay. It's, just, it's gone? God did it work. My guess. Bring Sochi down? Sure, man. Yeah, why not? Grandpa. Are you good, Grandpa? Thank you, young one. The curse didn't allow me to speak. I'm sorry I couldn't figure things out sooner, Grandpa. I treated you so horribly thinking you just pissed on the floor for no reason and just didn't talk to me? I'm sorry, man. No, you did more than what I dreamed for. You gave me a chance. Now listen, the raven is after me. It is using my wife to complete itself. Your wife? Grandma? I thought she passed away. The raven can interact with the dead. He has coursed her sword back to this world. The condition for his summoning is for the dead to perform the ritual on the person she loved the most. Now, you must save my wife's spirit. But how, Grandpa? How? Her bone box is in the altar. It should be sealed tight with a red string. Get it out of the house and the demon will back away. Okay, Grandpa. Use this. It should cut through anything. You have a good soul. I trust in you. Scissors. Oh. That's a lot less religious than I thought it was going to be. This? Or not this? What am I doing? Is Grandpa back or evil Grandpa? Oh. Hey. Sochi, I just wanted to be with you. I'm sorry. Or I think that's her, the wife speaking. Sorry, Chi. I just wanted to be with you. I'm sorry. Lady, you tried to stab me multiple times. What is wrong with you? Scissors. No. Oh, now is the time for compassion, huh? Now is the time to come to compassionate yourself. Oh, wait, that is a knife in their throat. Well, on the bright side, grandma is taken care of, I guess. I thought that was grandpa the whole time, but that's grandma. Is that hair? It kind of just looks like a... A big, like, spider web or something. I don't know what I'm doing, man. I've been recording for an hour. Let's get the hell out of here. I thought I was going to record for, like, 30 minutes and, like, have to, like, somehow string together a decent length, like, horror episode. But no, that worked out just fine for me, actually, because, um, the game was actually a lot longer than I expected. 
Okay, red box or red string, maybe. Whatever it said. Red, red something. All right, Grandpa, thanks for the scissors and all. But, you know, it would have been nice if you told me where the thing was. It would have taken you literally like two seconds to say, oh, by the way, it's in the living room. Idiot. That would have been nice. But no, instead, you give me nothing to work with. Thank you. Wait, 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 wait. No, I remember. I remember. It's upstairs. I, I remember the closet. There's like that weird like closet thing and there's like red stuff around it. I was going to question it, but I was more creeped out by the uh, like crowbar and the bloody note on the floor. So I kind of paid no attention to like the red strings and all that. All right, it's a wrap. Let's go. Go, 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 go. Bada bing, bada boom. Cut it open. What the hell is that? Bone box. Okay, what now? Do I have to, like, break it, or do I have to give it to Grandpa? Oh, that's nice. Locked inside. Monkey ass. What am I looking at? Oh, that's actually a guy! Don't tell me I gotta run. Don't- do not- please just be the end. Don't tell me I gotta run. I swear to God if you make me do another chase- What the hell? Huh? Wait. Huh? What? Ah! 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 What the hell? Okay, leave. We are leaving now. We are leaving. Um. Ooh, I don't like that sound. What the hell is that? Is that a demon to teleport? Where am I going? What is the dog doing? Ooh. Uh, uh, I don't know where I'm going. Oh, why is it flickering? What? I can't see. I can't see anything. Dude, just run and open doors, I guess. What the hell? Why is that there? Wow, my, my eyes. Okay. Did God save me? I think God saved me. Yeah, let's go with that. Thank you, God. He has it out for me. What the hell was all that? What? There was actually a raven. I I thought that was grandma or like a spirit called raven, like possessing grandma. But it was, but like it actually has like a physical form that is a raven with like big wings and like a big knife. What? Oh, thank God that's it. My heart can't handle any more of this, man. <laughs> I ran as fast as I can. Just when I ran out of breath, I saw a small, worn out building. It is an old temple. Just looking at it made me feel its history. This is the monk, right? The monk was talking about this, I think. I looked back. The Karasu Tengu was gone. Did I lose him? I decided to enter the temple. I saw a monk chanting, That's the guy! I was hesitant to disturb him, but he must have felt my presence. He slowly turned to me and stared at the bone box as he walked. The monk spoke before letting me speak. Here, give it to me! I handed the box without a second thought. My hands are still trembling from the adrenaline. Bro, my face and hands and throat are trembling from adrenaline as well. If you were a little late, the poor woman's spirit would have suffered a great deal. I was relieved. Suichi was right. It seems that his wife, Hari, was unharmed because I took the bone box out of the house. Didn't she stab herself in the neck? Alright, whatever, man. The monk then told me to bury it in a grave before it attracts anything else. He helped me do so, and he even offered a prayer of protection for me and the couple. I also prayed. Prayed that Harari is safely released, and Suichi to be as far away from the foul spirits as possible. I'm happy that Harari finally has the chance to watch over Suichi in the other world. But where did the Karasu Tenku go? Is he gone for good? Either way, I have to make sure that Suichi does not go back to there again. A few days have passed, and I decided to still care for Suichi. It's a nice sunny day. We're going to visit Hari's grave today. Now that we've had our moment of peace, I can finally greet her. God damn. That was a lot to stomach. It was already a lot to stomach that I had to do a original chase sequence. And then it was even more to stomach that I had to do a second chase sequence. God damn. At least it ended off on a happy note for once. Usually in all of these games, I end up dying at the end and it's like, well, the end, you know, L. But, you know, this is kind of nice. I, I like this ending. Unless I'm about to die now, then, you know. Can't say I didn't told you so. Ow. First at my ears. Ow. 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 
Can can you stop with the ringing? The ring ding ding a ding ding. Oh. Wait, wait, but I saved him. What? Ha! Huh? What a shame. He was already gone the moment you stepped into the house. Is this the Raven speaking? I gotta give him a different voice. He was already gone the moment you stepped into the house. What a shame. Well, that sucks. Wait, no, so I did end off at an L. What the hell? Jesus Christ, dude. This was amazing, man. It was way longer than I thought it was gonna be. It was hella scary because there were so many, like, jump scares. And at the end, dude, that chase sequence, it made me jump and, like, actually genuinely scream too many times to count, man. Dear God. I mean, the story is confusing as hell. Like, what happened at the end? I have no goddamn clue. Apparently, Grandpa was, uh, forever lost to the demons the moment I entered. So, that sucks. But, like, what about after I saved him, quote-unquote? Was that just the demon being like, Hey, you made it, Omega Lol, uh, low W. Or what? I don't know, man. I just don't know. But yeah, this was a- this was an amazing game, man. I mean, of course, the graphics aren't as good as, you know, the other Chilla's Art games. But, like, this game was made a while ago, so that's kind of what's expected. Either way, though, the spooks and, like, the scares and, like, the atmosphere and the story. Very good. I liked it. Go support them on Patreon, Chillazar or whatever, I'm sure you can find it. They're also making a new game soon called The Bathhouse, and I'll play that soon, whenever that comes out. Very excited. I, I guess that's it, now we just gotta wait until the credits are over and I'll do my little outro. God damn though, I... Dude, that last sequence, literally what did I say though? The last third of the game is when things pop off. And that's literally what happened. I didn't get a moment to rest in this entire last segment. It's just jump scare after jump scare after chase sequence after jump scare after another chase sequence. God damn. Hey, look at that last name over there. The best Patreon supporter, my god. Thanks for playing. Thank you for making this game, Chilozart. I'm pretty sure it's only made by like two people, like two siblings, I think, like brother and brother, who just decided to like make these like Japanese style horror games. And I think that's pretty awesome. I feel like indie developers just do the best at making like specific like new and like wacky awesome experiences like triple a studios they kind of suck at that nowadays you know like ea i can only really think of ea right now i think ubisoft as well you know those guys i don't know what they're doing but indie developers just do these things way better man whether that be like making like regular games or like horror games they just do it so much better somehow but uh yeah anyways fellas that's it for me thank you for watching this was an amazing experience Smash like, subscribe, turn on notifications, do it, or else you will be chased by that creepy, like, raven demon. I don't even know what the hell that thing was. Absolutely terrifying, though. But, uh, yeah. Anyways, fellas, I'll see you guys next time. Bye bye gamers.